spent in a miserable way. At least 12 children exposed to marijuana gummies, P0 life day. Mom arrested. On Monday, a teacher's aide at the school found the gummies in a room the children were in, and she noticed that the packaging said the candy contained drugs, according to a Cleveland Division of Police report. The school called to Cleveland Police arrested Shari Gould, the mother of a student who they say brought the candy to Anton to elementary school, on suspicion of endangering children, according to the report. Efforts to reach the police report says the student gave the candy to at least 12 others. 15 children, she said that a couple of the children complained of stomach aches. The police report noted that one of the children tested positive for a mind-altering chemical found in marijuana called tetrahydrocarabiol, also known as THC. The case is just one example of how accidental exposure to marijuana or other substances in young children can lead to health concerns. This when In a paper published in the journal last year, one and his colleagues found that visits to Children's Hospital Colorado related to marijuana exposures more than doubled in 2017 compared with in 2016, and calls to regional poison centers climbed. How? Meanwhile, Colorado's THC to help keep marijuana products out of the hands of young children, he recommends proper storage, such as keeping products up and out of reach in locked containers. Regulations, several states with legal recreational marijuana, including, and, have made child-resistant packaging a requirement for certain products. It's key to safely store marijuana products far from where children can see them, said Drive Susan Marzor. Director of Toxicology for and a Toxicology Consultant for the Washington Poison Center, who was not involved in the Cleveland case. Also, make young.